Good morning, everybody. Morgan, it's Monday. It's a beauty sunny day in the woods, below zero. And that means time for some cold weather gear review. USGI extreme cold weather system mittens. These things are actually pretty awesome. They were uh, my surprise buy a while back. I was trying to get uh, new mittens to replace the ones I had to return. And uh, I wanted Canadian ones just because it was used to what I was wearing. But uh, they didn't have any in large and I don't think I wanted to pay the price for them. But they had uh, Hero Outdoors had these USGI extreme cold weather system mittens. These things are awesome. Uh, 50 bucks Canadian from Hero Outdoors. Uh, it's well below zero with the wind chill. It's basically minus 25 right now. It's, it's, it's sunny. It's a beauty crisp day. These things are awesome. They're big, full-size gauntlets, fuzzy wool stuff on the back to wipe your nose. Uh, what should we call it? The liners. This is this is what really freaked me out when I first got them. They've been around a while. The liners just look like, you know, if you go back in time, oh, it looks like some guy got desperate, cut up his ranger blanket and made mitten liners with them. Because it's basically the exact same thing, a synthetic liner. I'm used to the felted wool liners in the Canadian one, so I was kind of skeptical. But I've been wearing these, and uh, these are surprisingly awesome. Uh, yeah, I got zero complaints for the temperatures. Uh, I've had no problems with the wind. And uh, yeah, it, it's, it's wild. They're, uh, they're deceptively awesome. That's the best way to put it. Hang on. Okay, so as you can see, they're a two-piece construction. Uh, the inner, the outer. The outer's got this awesome leather palm, fuzzy stuff on the back. Giant gauntlets with dum-dum strings that I've tied here because I think they should hang horizontally as opposed to vertically. If you hang them vertically, stuff can just fall in them like snow, ice, rain, whatever. So uh, I found a picture from back in the day that showed some guy had them tied there. And I was like, hey, that makes total sense. And then they just hang horizontally. And yeah, the wind can still blow in them, but nothing's going to fall into them. And then you've got your synthetic liner. And yeah, we'll get a quick... Uh, Try to get a quick shot of current temperature. Let's see if you can see that. So, what is it? According to this, it's like minus 12. It is almost the warmest part of the day. So, found this great spot. Got a great new spot out in the woods where I can shoot videos uh, relatively close to home. Uh, wife was getting all excited she didn't want me going out to my regular winter fun spot because it is like 20k away and then you're into the woods she's like oh if you get hit in the head or anything we might not find you in time it's all a point honey the insurance is paid up too anyhow that's my two cents i think these are great these are 50 bucks well spent uh i've never used a lot of u.s equipment other than like the ranger blanket which is you know heaven sent and uh the poncho but uh, yeah, for cool weather, if you're up here in Canada or anywhere it's cold <laughs> and you can get a pair of these, I, I know they're even cheaper in the States, which is like super wicked awesome, but <laughs> get a pair. It's money well spent. I might even get another pair. I might sacrifice a pair for work. I don't know. They're that awesome and they're that cheap. Uh, yeah, those are my two cents. I'll put the link to Hero Up Doors out. And uh, I, there's another kid who did an outside review. Good for you, kid. Uh, because really tabletops are great but uh, people want to see you outside using them and uh, yeah, they're totally worth your money. Alright everybody, have a great day. Thanks. Bye. Oh yeah, before I forget I can't remember if I did it or Crab people, crab people. Your manual dexterity goes out the window. Uh, they're awesome, they keep your hands warm but yeah, seriously, crab people, crab people. Uh, you're going to need a set of glove liners if you're going to be taking your hands in and out of these all the time. Uh, we'll credit Trey Parker and Matt Stone from South Park for the crab people's idea. But, rah, 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 rah. yeah, that's that. Okay, thanks everybody.